Welcome to Animal A Day. 10 Roadrunner Facts. No match for a coyote. 1. Roadrunners, or chaparral birds, are a genus of two species of birds in the cuckoo family, the greater roadrunner and the lesser roadrunner. 2. The greater roadrunner is found in Mexico, the south central United States, as well as the southwest United States. The lesser roadrunner is native to Central America and slightly different parts of Mexico. 3. Though they can fly, they prefer to sprint away from threats. Some have been able to run as fast as 27 miles per hour, or 43 kilometers per hour. Unlike the cartoons, real life coyotes run much faster than roadrunners, so they could easily catch them. 4. They're sometimes called snake killers because they, well, kill snakes. They fearlessly face off with the venomous snakes and can deftly dodge all of their attacks. Eventually, the roadrunner will grasp the back of the snake's neck, slam its head into the ground until it dies, and slurp it up like spaghetti. 5. It's a medium-sized bird measuring up to 2 feet or 60 centimeters long, including its tail feathers. It weighs about one half a pound to one pound, or 230 to 430 grams. 6. To conserve energy at night, they have the ability to lower their own body temperature by up to 15 degrees Fahrenheit, or 9.5 degrees Celsius. To warm back up in the morning, they extend their feathers to absorb the sun's rays. 7. They get all of their water needs through the prey they consume. Besides the aforementioned snakes, they eat lizards, small mammals, small birds, eggs, insects, and some plant matter like fruit. Only around 10% of their diet comes from fruit and foliage. 8. They are one of only a few brave animals that hunt tarantula hawks. Most species avoid these wasps because of their incredibly dangerous and painful stings. 9. Roadrunners are monogamous, so once they find a partner, they stay together for life. A male will dance and sing for a female he fancies, and bring her food. If she likes him, they will build and defend their nest together, as well as their massive territory. The parents stay together year-round and take turns protecting their eggs and later their chicks. And 10. They became New Mexico's state bird in 1949, and have remained so ever since. Thanks for watching, now take that subscribe button to the zoo.